Good morning! Well, I am so excited to show you guys this vintage uh, mid-century Japan black lacquered bar. I know that's a mouthful, but there's a lot of cool things in there uh, to discuss. Um, and uh, the, the functions on it are, are even better. So uh, yeah, let's let's get started. So I mentioned it is a bar. I can show you first how, uh, um, how that functions. Get ready for this. I mean, every part of what I'm going to show you, I think, is just fantastic. <laughs> so the top opens up with a little bit of protest. Um, it's got this really great picture on the back. Look, you can see how brightly colored those shell appliques are. And then in the front, you pull the pulls. Check out the pulls. Aren't they neat? So you pull the front door down. You have a mirrored bar top. And then these pieces open up for extra space. And then look at the inside. So it's got a space for, um, for bottles. Another um, uh, uh, mirrored top. Sorry, I've had a hard time today. Um, yeah, so the, the bar function is really, really neat. Here, I'll close it back up so we can look at the rest of it as well. Um, and then there's a lot of storage built in as well. So check out, pretty much every panel here opens. On the side, we have little cabinets here. These shelves are all removable once the door is out of the way. Um, so these slide out, easy for cleaning. Even the corners open up. Look at this. See, again, some really cool pulls for wine glass storage. And then the bottom cabinet also opens up. And it has a drawer with space for uh, bottles. Isn't that wild? It is just the coolest piece of furniture, um, functionally. I mean, I just. Um, I love something that you can fidget with, and there are so many um, little doors and uh, panels to open that uh, this one definitely fits. <laughs> fits that bell. And then decoratively, on top of it, um, yeah, really great. Um, so there's a little bit of scratches. There's a little bit of scratches at the top. Um, the lacquer is um, not in great condition, as you can say. It's like chipping in some places. Um, and so it's a, it's a European imitation of. Um, East Asian lacquering. So that's why it's called Japan. Um, and then it has these uh, scenes drawn on top and then it's got these shell appliques on top. Aren't they cool? So you can see they uh, have a little bit of height to them or depth, I suppose is better. Um, that's actually kind of some of their downfall. As you can see, um, there's a few where the ladies are missing. So here on the side, and here, this one's missing your body, and this one's missing your head. Um, but yeah, overall, really cool decoration. And actually, there's just so much going on, um, I don't even notice that those are missing. Uh, but yeah, really, really cool piece of furniture, super unique. And uh, oh, look at this one again. Yeah, super unique. And uh, yeah, I don't know what else to say. It's just, yeah, the, the coolest thing. Um, so you can check this out um, here at the warehouse. We're open every day from 12 to 5 p.m. Uh, it is priced at $185, um, which I think is a really good price for something this neat. Um, but of course, it does have those condition issues, so um, keep that in mind when considering it. Um, and it's also um, probably going to be listed soon on the marketplace, so um, if it doesn't sell here in the warehouse first, uh, so you can check there as well. Uh, but uh, yeah, we have a ton of other um, really great furniture here at the warehouse, so you can uh, visit to see it all in person. We're open every day from 12 to 5 p.m. And uh, yeah, if you have any questions about um, our nonprofit and how you can purchase or donate materials, uh, please put them in the comments and uh, I will get back to you. But otherwise, thanks a lot for joining me for this really awesome piece of furniture. Um, I'm probably going to be here playing with it for another couple hours. <laughs> um, and I hope you enjoyed as much as I do. Um, have a great day.